Welcome to Ballard Bluff. My husband Bobby and I recently moved to a new home overlooking the lake and one of our neighbors started calling it Ballard Bluff. When I was showing a friend some pictures of our new home and its huge kitchen, she suggested that I start teaching cooking classes. Now any of you who know me know that that is truly laughable. But then I started thinking about it. I could do some videos showing some of the things that I make when I do cook. I'm your host, Jane Ballard, and I'm going to share some easy recipes with you. Hi everybody, welcome to my kitchen. Today we are going to make blueberry orange muffins. You're going to start with a blueberry muffin mix, any brand will do. You're going to prepare that by the directions on the box, and then you're going to add a can of mandarin oranges, just drained, that's all you have to do to it. Mix those up together, we're going to throw them in a muffin tin, and that's it, except we are going to make a crumb topping for them. We're going to start with the blueberry muffin mix. Throw that in there. This particular recipe or box calls for two eggs. And, oh yeah, I made a nice mess with that one. <laughs> Cracking eggs isn't my strong point. To that we're going to add a quarter cup of oil and three quarters of a cup of water. And that's what this particular box calls for. Mix that up really well. Mmm, boy, it smells good already. <laughs> there we go, getting that all mixed up real good. Oh, couple of lumps. Gotta mix those in. Alright, looks good. I have my blueberries and my oranges already drained and ready to throw in. There we go. Now you don't want to stir that too roughly because you don't want to break everything up, but you want to get it nice and incorporated. So just give it a gentle stir and you'll get that muffin mix all ready to put in the tin. You're going to want to use either a very well greased muffin tin or you can put uh, the muffin cups in it. I'm going to set that aside right now and we're going to make the crumb topping. For the crumb topping we have a quarter cup each of flour and sugar and we have a teaspoon of cinnamon and we're going to just kind of mix that all up together in this bowl first. And I'm using a, a fork to do that because, oh, let's get that cinnamon in there. you got to have cinnamon all the way over. There we go. I'm going to throw in two tablespoons of butter. And we're going to have that at room temperature so it'll mash up really well there. So, and then you just start mixing it in there, mashing and pressing and making a crumb topping. I won't bore you with the details while I get all this done, but we're going to make that crumb topping. We're going to put that on top of the muffins and then we're going to put that in the oven at 400 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. I'll be back with you in a bit. Wow, look what I have. Fresh, hot, right out of the oven. I'm going to set them on this cooling rack here. Try not to burn fingers and lose all the crumb topping. Ah, there we go. Don't those look delicious? Man, can't wait to try them. I am going to let them cool just a little bit because I think it's a little too warm right now. We'll get one of these and sample it out by the bluff here in a minute. Here we are on the porch overlooking Ballard Bluff. It's a kind of cool afternoon, overcast little tiny bit of a breeze, but other than that it's a beautiful day. I brought out one of the muffins. We're going to give that a sample here in a minute. I want to thank you for joining me 
for the blueberry orange muffin episode. Join me again for some other recipes, fast and easy and simple. I want to thank you for joining me today. This is Jane Ballard from Ballard Bluff. See you next time.